Hi, I'm Victoria Ward. I'm a physician at Stanford School of Medicine and the medical director for Digital Medic. Welcome back to Viral Effects. Today we're going to talk about one of the more difficult sequelae of COVID, called long COVID. So first, what is it? Post-COVID syndrome, or long COVID, are symptoms that persist for weeks or even months after being infected with a virus. So while COVID symptoms typically last about two weeks, long haulers can have symptoms lingering at least a month and sometimes even many months after initial infection. Long COVID occurs in about 10 to even 30% of those people who've been infected. Typically, the symptoms are chronic fatigue, usually described as debilitating exhaustion, as well as headache, trouble sleeping, and brain fog. Other symptoms are shortness of breath, chest tightness, muscle aches, and diarrhea. Unfortunately, long COVID can happen to anybody, regardless of how severe their infection was initially. So even those with very mild symptoms are unfortunately still at risk. So why does this happen? Well, patients aren't reinfected with COVID. Actually, the majority of testing is negative. But the thought is that it's a continuation of their initial infection. The cause of post-COVID syndrome, though, is still unknown. We do know that it can occur in anyone, regardless of disease severity. So this is one of the main reasons to really try to avoid getting the COVID virus. So how do you protect yourself from post-COVID syndrome? Well, the best way to prevent these symptoms is by getting vaccinated against COVID-19 as soon as possible. You're much less likely to contract the virus if you're vaccinated, and therefore much less at risk for developing post-COVID syndrome. Reminder that vaccination is recommended for those who are 12 years and older. And it is important to get even if you've already had COVID-19 in the past. So what should you do if you end up getting COVID symptoms that last longer than a month? Well, it's important to drink lots of fluids and rest. Try to eat a nutritious diet rich in vitamins and minerals and manage stress as much as possible. You should also contact your doctor for further information. Well, that's all for today. We'll be back soon with more answers to your COVID-19 questions. And until then, take a look at the other videos in our Viral Facts playlist.